When released, shield propels debris at nearby enemies. When holding shield, use evade to rush enemies and knock them back. Energy will recover while shield is active. Yeah, you didn't do that either, did you? Yeah, no. Launch large enemies when their health is low. Yeah. Yeah, I want to do that. Launch large objects. Yeah, I want to do that too. I just want to throw all the stuff, really. That's all I really care about. 50% to launch damage? Yeah. And not enough points for that. Okay. Forward countermeasures. Let's collect the reward. Which I don't think was that great. Kill his guards in the executive sector using spin. Kill enemies without dying. I can do that, no problem. You see some bugs? You ate dog food? These are both things that I never did as a kid. I just didn't want to. I never felt the desire to do that. I'm not judging you for having done it. Because I can understand the temptation. What a boring childhood? Yeah, I guess so. French was shot dead by himself. Jesse, you made it. I did. And you lifted the internal lock. Listen, Cat food is Emily. tastier. Screw it. Just tell her. I haven't been. What do you mean, his kids? <laughs> I have a younger brother, Dylan. When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in Ordinary's landfill. The slides created doorways to other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. But we found help. Through one of the doorways, we met something. A being. A being? What kind of being? It's hard to describe, but it... She helped us. We managed to turn the projector off. The bad things that came through the doorways... were gone. <laughs> After that, your people came. Tried to grab us. I ran away. They got Dylan. I left them behind. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. He covered it up. No one believed me. I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to the slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I never heard of it, but around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. A large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. The case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since Ordinary. In my head. She led me to you. I call her... Polaris. As in, a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the hiss? If she got you in here, in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. Which may help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. 
Now, cross-referencing them with the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes. But one was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. Is that Dylan? Hmm. The other match is on something called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attack. So, Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my key card. The sector elevator will it's take a level you there. three. Yes. I don't think I've seen a level three anywhere though yet so far. Marshall is the next step. What Emily told me about ordinary my powers being connected to things in the bureau's past. I am so close to something. Do you feel it? Something's coming. Hey, Zachary, I'm good. How are you? I helped you. You owe me now. What do you mean? And when time comes, I will come calling. I fed the... I fed the waste to the furnace for you, Atia. I don't owe you anything. Awesome, Zachary. Congrats. It feels good, right? <laughs> he was, oh, I thought you were like, like Drano or something, Borealis. I thought that's what you were trying to say. Uh, how far have you made it into uh, Days Gone? Or is that what you've been streaming lately, or have you have you streamed that yet? You don't like this Ati guy? I think we should feed him to the furnace. <laughs> no, no, we don't do that. I like him because of his accent. Oh, really, Smidge? Huh. Astral Plane is in conflicts. The hiss will come for all. You must stop them. You must shut up them! <laughs> I like that better. So, alright, there's the board countermeasures, mission briefings, uh... Harder targets, old boys club. But oh, wait, what's this one? Hang on a second. Where does this? So how do we? I don't even know where to go. Wait, nostalgia department? <laughs> Executive affairs, director's office. Go to the NSC energy converters. Okay, well that's that's my that's my thing. NSC energy converters. There's no other way to create that kind of energy. Those are NSC energy converters entrance. Okay. You wonder if it plays a part in this? Yeah, maybe. Saving up hundred dollars for a new PC monitor, and I'm already seventy six dollars in. They got it from bits. Nice. Been streaming dying light. Uh I left off on Days Gone. I just got to the lower part of the map. Oh, cool. I haven't played Dying Light yet. That's that's sort of my list for us at some point. I've heard it's good. So from here... Isn't that... Let's see here. Oh, game. Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, I, I knocked him out with on the way in. This guy's strong. He's a strong boy.
Oh! 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 Dude, this guy is... He's made out of bears! Oh, <laughs> wait, beer alert fa Oh, right, without dying. The dying license 2015 and have 15,000 hours in it? Whoa. That's, that's some hours in a game. That's impressive. So do I still have that mission, even though I failed it? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, and... Oh, damn it. So, wait a minute. So, I don't have... So, that mission I just failed, and now I can't do it again? Oh, that sucks. Yeah, he regens quickly. Yep. Huh. Okay, well, that was too bad. My right, poem informs Jesse that Marshall went to the research sector to create more HRAs. Jesse believes Marshall may know more about Dylan. So. So we're going to fast travel here. We need to figure out where we're going then, where that actually is. Mailroom communications, dead letters. I guess we'll go back to central executive and then figure out where we have to go from there. Maybe we need to take the service elevator, right? Because the service elevator is now... Or was this what was open before? This was open before. It wasn't there. Oh, here we go. Research sector. Perfect. I knew all along. I think we're in central research. Somebody thought this video would make for great internal communications. I'm looking at you, Mr. Tomasi. So, this is where the magic happens. Anyway, I I've been here for 24 years now. I've always been here. And, and through those years, we've made astonishing discoveries authored studies of great importance, and in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance, and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. Huh. Nice. End it with a smile. Research sector, huh? Home of the Bureau's mad scientists. Plant complaint? Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants and research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice, and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe you could just switch it up a bit. I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted, and people like them a bit too much, if you ask me. Are we being invaded by houseplants? Worth looking into. Yeah, that's what we just saw, I think. Wait, there's a new mission? Oh. What? No, apparently not. Okay. Where's the manual? You like this guy? Seems like a good guy. Down in front. Oh God, what's... Well. 
I don't know how this thing is powered. Oh, great. I can't grab them. Kill enemies without dying, and it starts. Hop up. I'll get you. I got him. Did you shoot at me? So we've got parapsychology and then Dr. Darling's office and dimensional researcher upstairs. Oh, we've got to go to parapsychology, which was downstairs. All right, I guess we're not going up quite yet. Keep moving. Supervisor. Why are they calling the supervisor? Okay. How do I feel about puzzle games? I enjoy puzzle games. What? It's gotta be one more, there it is. There is no game, I haven't heard of it, no. Intrusive pattern. I don't know that I've seen those before. Oh, I'm so ready to. Th She's in trouble. I need to reach her. Okay. Seems a little of it. Seems funny. All right. Okay, cool, Otto. Oh. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Just a little bit of health, just a little bit. Just to take the edge off. I was like prepared for him and I still missed. I think there's one more down there, maybe two. made more intense by what is going on in here huh. uh, it's made more intense by this trying not to die does them no justice. Now, the white non-space, the ever-present inverted black pyramid, the board, all linked, intrinsically tied to the oldest house, tied to the director, the process of choosing a director, tied to all objects of power in terms of who controls them. Yes. Okay, it's good. Good stuff. Insufficient, insufficient. We could do, we can construct a spin. Spin as a generous magazine and a high rate of fire. What I don't know is if, how we switch between those. What happens when we do? I guess I should probably just try it and see. New weapon form constructed, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Construct Pierce. Pierce is precise with a charged shot that penetrates armor and enemies at any range. And then mods I could make. Construct a random weapon mod. Uncommon. I guess? Sure? I mean... Okay. Yeah. Why not? We can do this. More launch damage. We have three more points. We do this again. Okay. All right, so that's good there. Wait, what did it tell me? So F is to switch weapon form. Okay. So, all right, so now we've got spin. It's generous magazine, high rate of fire, best using control bursts, damage while low on health, yep. Extra damage. Seven, we could put that in. What else do we have? Accuracy, energy gain from headshots, rate of fire. I don't know we need to have a higher rate of fire. 
Uh, this can be deconstructed. Accuracy, we can get rid of that. But I think, I think maybe we take this. So we find ourselves in... Oh, I have another another one of these I can do too? I didn't even realize. Okay. Launch energy reduced by 11%, maybe? Maybe we take that? And we currently have what? Increased health pickup. Which I kind of like. So yeah, if something goes wrong, we can... We can, maybe we can switch to this gun if we have to. It's not going to gain us health, but it's going to kill things quicker. I just have to remember to switch between weapons. I'm actually going to pull that off. An early hypothesis was that the mindscape of the astral plane is subjective. But that was fast proven wrong. It's an actual place. Not a construct of the mind, even though it is with our minds that we enter and experience it. But then, one could argue that that's the case with all reality. We've been able to record footage of the astral plane by monitoring the brain activity of those experiencing it. That is the only concrete material that has come out of the astral plane expeditions. Uh, apart from one shocking exception. In the astral plane footage, we're always in the vicinity of the pyramid. We've concluded that this, not the entire plane, is what the board controls. We have glimpsed movement, native species, always in the distance, and yet contact was made. We don't have footage of this, a technical malfunction, but when one of our astral knots returned, a brain cloud, astral knots, had hitchhiked a ride in his head. It ruptured out, killing the subject in question. It's a relentless predator pursuing thoughts, minds, lethal to those the entity feeds on. Proper containment protocols are to be observed when dealing with it. Hmm. So that's like a representation. Is that where we were? Was the astral plane then? When we're going through that stuff? I think it is. Wait, there's got to be something more in here. Astral ex uh, Exhibition. Alright, so, uh, his sniper, Bureau Sniper specializing in eliminating threats from a distance using the telltale searchlights fixed their rifles to search for targets. His snipers are no less lethal. The corruption has not changed their tactics. They clearly prefer to maintain a good distance from their target, waiting in elevated positions for a clear shot. Care should be taken in open spaces. Check the balconies. I should note that their rifles are equipped with a bayonet for close quarters combat, and the his snipers are well aware of how to use it. Alright, so... The Astral Exhibition was originally built for the Astral Knots to use as a training location, a place to grow accustomed to the sights and sounds of the Astral Plane before diving into the real thing. We could have done a better job with it, but Blank was being stingy with the budget. However, once we discovered the Blank, we decided to repurpose the space. Similar to how zoos hope familiar surroundings will affect the well-being of their animals, we hope to observe the Blank, uh, Blank's behavior in an environment similar to its home dimension. So far, it just breaks everything we put in with it, but Rome wasn't built in a day. Uh, whoops, addendum. New naming conventions have been established for the astral entity now known as Astral Spike. Outdated terms in this report have been redacted. Synchronicity is a phenomenon uh, long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen cords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce blank uh, behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may not remember our names, but God himself will. Uh, red. 911, what is your emergency? Hello? Hello, I'm here. Can you hear me? I can hear you, ma'am. Where are you? I'm um, inside the wires. I'm lost. Ma'am, have you been drinking tonight? 
I feel like I'm stretching through the wires towards you. Don't hang up. I might go if you hang up. Go where, ma'am? Go. Gone. Away. Okay, and can you describe your surroundings? Ma'am, hello. Ma'am? Dispatcher attempted to call the number back, but it was no longer in service. Jesus. That's like the things we saw in the astral plane. I can't believe they keep that thing here. I'm gonna go down in there with it. 